Hello, my name is Sushmita Singh and I'm from Carmel, Indiana. I'm currently working as a RN in the emergency department here at Community Health. And my experience with pediatric or adolescent population kind of extends uh, to the fact that ER, where I work, has pediatric as well as adults uh, as, as, as its patient population. And I have taken care of infants as young as four days old and of course adolescents in all kind of capacities whether it's medical and uh, psychiatric in in case of uh, older children and adolescent population so that has been my experience uh, what do i know of pediatric adolescent population specific health needs or vulnerabilities i know this much that um, they are uh, definitely fall under the vulnerable uh, criteria severely because they are prone to abuse, they are prone to neglect, malnutrition, as well as they are at a in their life span. Their little lifespan consists of not only growth but constant change in terms of their body, their mind, and their personalities. So, with that in mind. We have to be extremely careful um, when it comes to assessment. They have very particular needs in terms of assessment. They have very specific needs in terms of medication so, so that we are medicating them appropriately with consideration for their delicate anatomy. Um, so these are the very specific needs. And of course, uh, when it comes to advocating, this is the population that we have to be advocating for aggressively and from the forefront because obviously they are not the ones who would express um, their concerns, their discomfort, their challenges. Probably they aren't even aware of it. Um, so that we have to be very observant of those things. Um, we have to be cognizant of the fact that their families uh, particularly their parents would like to be engaged in their treatment plan and we must make all accommodations possible for them to be participating and it actually works out in our favor in terms of success of our therapy that uh, as we engage parents who feel responsible towards their children uh, to participate in their treatment plan and execution. So these are my observa observations and of course, I am currently working with a pediatric psychiatric mental health nurse practitioner who is very experienced. She has over 20 years of experience in this, with this patient population. And I'm getting to learn a lot when it comes to practicing assessment sensitively, uh, suggesting what they seem appropriate or what, what works for them and kind of like customizing treatment plan. Um, especially when it comes to teenagers because they are very independent minded and they have ideas of their own and if you don't kind of make them feel like they are responsible and yes they are being heard then the treatment plant is not going to work with that population so these are the things that I'm learning and I'm excited about this uh, initially I was very I went in with the mindset thinking that I'm not going to ever work with this patient population, but uh, my favorite is adults. But my, as I'm working, as I've begun to work with these patients, I feel like I might, I might just enjoy them. So I'm looking forward to it. And I wish all my classmates the very best and a great career ahead. Thank you.